every cycle you feel something else, and then American Idiot, because we were, we were, um, it, it, it wasn't everything we were writing before was sort of, you know, it was sort of uh, self-deprecating and and like uh, it maybe a little bit more internal. Um, this time there was, it was the first time we were speaking out, and that was. Um, I remember people coming in to listen to that record for the first time, and. Uh, and I couldn't even be in the room, you know. I was just like, don't, you know, it's like we didn't have to mix, mix the record yet. So there's different people that were coming in. So I was like, all right, see you later. I'm going to go somewhere else. So, I mean, like that time I felt like, it, and, and it's like that's a really, you know, that fear is a really important thing to feel. I mean, because I think it's your friend, you know. So being around, like, the actors and, and, and Michael and everybody as part of the crew, it's just like, I, it's been a whole brand new learning experience for me. And it's like, you know, Green Day is like, you know, theatrical, you know, and, and then the fact that we make complete jackasses of ourselves. <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> Trey, Trey is like wearing a bra, I mean, she gets dressed. And, you know, it's like I've played Madison Square Buck naked before. Yeah. <laughs> and, You know, and then just seeing what the actors do and, and the way they've taken a song and made characters out of them. And it's, it's not a book, it's not a script per se, it's, it's songs. They had to sort of make it come to life. And, you know, and I didn't have very many conversations with them, you know, it, it, about it. They didn't ask me much about it. So, it, you know, John and Tony and Stark to have come up with it. It's been unbelievable, you know. So, hell yeah, very inspiring. For me to be uh, in the presence of, of this guy, who I, yeah, I, I think he's a poet, I really do. I think that he's a great American poet. Thank you.